Shake it, what's up? Say it. Now you guys are like, fuck that shit. Say it sucks. What's up? Sup? What's up? What's up? What's up? We did have we did have an intro, but I just said fuck it. I was gonna come out here and say sup. You ever walk into a place and say sup to somebody? Yeah. Half of them are like, the fuck this guy just say? The other half of them were like, oh shit. I better say sup. Uh, fuck that. I'm fucking Fred Flintstone and my ankles are bigger than your dick. And when I please your lady, no, there is no pleasing with any ladies happening. Because when you have a stomach this big, yeah. Men know and ladies know. Alright, we're crematorium from Los Angeles, California. We're going to do a little bit of death metal and a whole lot of comedy. If you feel like coming up front, come up front. If you feel like coming out of the closet, it's about goddamn time. Take the vocals out of the front, fuck them. No, just fuck them. Don't take them out, just don't have any of the vocals down here because I'm, I sound louder than anyone else. Yeah, what's up, girls?
We have merch for sale in the back for really cheap. Like five bucks. Or you can give this ass for three. Uh. <laughs> have you seen this before? How many of you guys have seen this before? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty fucking cool. If you've seen this before, there used to be a skinnier version of me. But then once you hit fucking 42 and your testosterone starts moving, now by 45, fuck yeah. One thing that Cricket Tour always has been is a political band. But this today's political climate, with everyone that's on Trump's side or liberal, Democrats, liberals, I've decided to reshift myself. I'm all about humanity. Government does not give a fuck about any single one of you dummies in here. You pay your taxes, you do everything. These guys over here are watching fucking sports ball, and that's all they care about. You ain't my fucking team! Fuck yeah! Your team doesn't care about you, dummy. You know who cares about you? Your fucking self. You are nobody unless you fucking make yourself somebody. So whether you believe in fucking Cheeto, or Killery, or fucking the Dodgers, or the Lakers, or Shaq, or these nuts that are non-existent anymore, you will not be shit until you become something for yourself. This song is about you guys. Ground yourself. Show a little pride. If you're depressed, yeah, it fucking sucks. Take a big ass fucking pill of deal with it. Internationals are playing. 
Or someone's gonna bang, take a big turd and everyone on that side is betting on it. I'm guessing that this guy over here is not gonna get laid. <laughs> not for a lack of a big dick, but just for a lack of trying. Alrighty then. Cook is over there cooking up them tacos. Doing it all. So, it took him five hours to get here tonight. Give it up to him. He lives up there the fire line. I live right below the fire line. It took me three and a half hours to get here. After, if you don't see us, we're going back to our homes because our shit's on fucking fire, dudes. Fuck yeah! Lit! It's fucking 2019! It's like, this, is the, this is the third fucking time in fucking three years that my house has been fucking engulfed by flames, but I'm sitting there and I'm fighting them. You're not gonna take it. Here's some manteca. Here's some manteca. Manteca, manteca, manteca. But have you ever really looked at some of the conspiracy theories that people talk about way back in the day? I did. Have you found out that these started becoming true? What the fucking fuck? I'm telling you again, Democrats, liberals, Republicans, all that shit. It's a fucking device to fuck you guys. And I'm sitting up there looking at these fires and I see somebody running away. You know who it is? It's Hillary and both the brothers on Trump's side. Because they're just trying to fuck us all up. We got a song for you. This one is called Mandy. hands up. You sit here thinking about how you will die. How many people will mourn you? How many people will miss you? How many people will come there and speak at your funeral? How many people will say that you did something? Had something to say? Had children? Had grandchildren? Did something? 
How many people in here have thought about the day that they die? Think about the fucking day that you live. Stop dreaming about death. Death is finite. Living and creating your own pathway is not. You can change what you are tonight, but you cannot change the way that you die. Keep that in mind, man. Keep that in mind. This next song goes out to anybody who's ever decided to walk a path and say, fuck it, I hope no one shows up to my funeral because I'm happy with who the fuck I am. behind this shit. Doing this shit, I joined Crematorium in 1995. There was a whole band before me, and we kept going. We went on tours. We toured with our brothers in Malaysia a few times. And we always felt that when we were out there. And death metal, that. Death metal's fun. It's cool singing about death. But what about life? So I've been singing this message that I have and if you've seen me before you really know that I don't care if you like me or not because I love myself I got big ass titties, a small ass dick and I can shit anywhere I want we got a few more left for you guys but I also want you guys to realize that we appreciate you guys out here this is our, well, that's our last song and fuck it. hell fuck it, yeah cause I'm, if you don't know Oh shit, I'm losing hair. Well, I'm here. But actually, the message is, is that take something away from life, man. Do something with yourselves. Death metal is fucking fun. Metal is fucking fun. When you leave these buildings, remember, you guys are the vanguards of what happens outside. Whoever you believe in. Trump, fucking Liberals, which are fucking, I'm a liberal, but I fucking hate liberals right now. They sound like a bunch of contagious fucking cocksuckers, but they don't even want to admit they suck cock. It's horrible. You know what we should all admit? We are fucking humans, and if a fucking Mack truck knocks us down, we some dead motherfuckers, suck. Huh? Thank you so much to George Lucas for letting me steal that thing from Jar Jar Binks. Look at that song. Coming on that stage is our homies from Sophophagus. They got bigger dicks than we do. And after that, it's blood. It can what? 
Ah, fuck you guys. Blood Inc. Kid. That's right. And then after that is Imbo. Ah, uh, fuck you guys. What's after that? That's right. Love you guys. Talk a lot of shit, but really, you're a lot better than I am. Oh, <laughs> 